from another crack mother. What's going on now? JB, niggas gone AWOL, baby. I don't know what to do. Is he ever not AWOL? He's bad, Franklin. Got his claws in deep this time. They're on to him, leaving messages, saying he gonna get cut. You ain't gonna let a sister starve. Look, man, I'm not gonna let that happen, all right? Now leave it with me. chance you could take me to a mechanic so I can get that death trap fixed? That's a bad place to break down. Yeah, it started spluttering at the crossing. Then the engine just cut out. Damn car, foreign trash. I've told my wife a hundred times. But she's like, oh no, Phil, you can't say that. Not anymore. She'll soon change her tune when she finds out I nearly died. All this fancy eco crap they put in cars now. We never asked for it. We never signed that treaty. A mile less to the gallon, and maybe I wouldn't have ended up on top of the train tracks. I'm at a loss for words. Could have fooled me. Makes a nice change, though, to get towed for a good reason. Normally, I'd be cussing you out, you know, asking you how you sleep at night. I'm sure you would, man. You been in the business long? Uh, I ain't exactly in the business. Just helping out a friend, dog. Okay, thanks again. That could have been much worse. If it ain't the finest man in South L.S. You could tell J.B. I did his work for him again. I will, boo. Soon as he wakes up.
Yeah, sorry about that. That's dumb luck right there. Guess who's getting 
sustain a work-related injury and suing your ass for six figures. Crew guys on a rooftop going at it. Lady downstairs in the bikini. Let's see if we can connect the dots. I got you, you creep. I thought he might it's have been cross-dressing, but he ain't. Reckless driver sighted 
crossing Dorset Drive. Suspect sighted near the Life Invader offices. He's turned off Del Perro, down an alleyway. You see him? Lost sight of suspect near a parking garage. Request ground units to investigate. Pilot boy! Pick us down. I need to see inside the building. car might be worth something, but it ain't. It's, it ain't got no resale. Zilch. They only made ten of these. I think anyone... Whoa, whoa, whoa! It's your... Suspect down! Fine work, ground unit! Mr. Clinton. Hey, Molly, right? I got that car for y'all. The Z-Type? Mr. Weston will be glad you caught us. He wanted to see it before we took off. We're on the way to his personal hangar at Los Santos International. I'll tell them to expect you at the gate. All right. Hey, I'm delivering the ride to Los Santos International. Hey, is the lady gonna be there? Or just a dick who ain't paying us till we get all the cars? Shit, I think they both gonna be there, dog. Devin and Molly. Say hello from me to Molly. Man, I ain't hitting on nobody for you, man. At least the ball hurt. Come on, why not? It's about time I settled down. Shit, man, you need like a lion tamer or some shit. This girl, man, she got balls, dog, but she needs some serious stones to handle your ass. Just say hello. <laughs> man, I ain't gonna be a part of that. After everything I've done for you, ah, you are just like Michael. Hey, I'm supposed to meet Devin Weston here. Mr. Weston's hangar is up there on the left.
there she is. <laughs> you know, if this beauty was a woman, I'd have to break my 20 and under rule. Man, I'll just stick to driving, all right? <laughs> hey, tell me something. You know how many of these things they made? Uh, shit, like 10? No, not like 10, man. Exactly 10. Oh, wow, man. You one of them type of dudes, huh? Tell you something. How'd you like to drive a car like this one, then, man? For real. Like this? Or this. Oh, man, right back at me, homie. Really nice. Hey, you know something? You're not like those uh, snowbird retiree pals of yours. You are sharp, man. Man, I'm just looking for a paycheck for my services. No, 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 don't worry. It'll come. That'll come. But right now, it is life lesson time, pal. You have got to wake up to what's real in this situation, bro. Take me, right? I am opportunity. I'm security. I'm fast cars, blow jobs. I got the world on a plate. Those two clowns, oh, man, they are the worst kind of disaster that can ever come down. They are a full core meltdown, and you're just standing there soaking up major radiation. You have got to take stock, man. Make that call before it's too late. Yeah, all right, man, I will. Before it's too late, man. Yeah, yeah. Just take any car and go. Rancho. Right away, sir. That's the ride, my man. Yeehaw! Rob me again! This is Dispatch. Broken down car at Spanish Avenue. Who's in the vicinity? Over. Yeah, I'll take that. 10 4. Copy that. Clear after you.
people like an hour ago. Just get me to a mechanic. I still don't have time for this right now. Seriously, I'm... Fuck! The unacceptable response time. I'm just saying. Shit, you can get out and walk if you don't like it. Whoa, simmer down, buddy. I'm not blaming you, per se. You're just the little man. I know that. I'm just saying, there has to be accountability. Not at the drudge level, but up top. I keep posting negative reviews online, and it's like nobody reads them. I know they don't. I get daily stats. You know, I've been towed three times in the last month, and the quickest response was 47 minutes. I'm just saying, maybe they need a new system. Or maybe you need a new car. Like I say, I'm not blaming you. My problem's with the Oh shit! My problem's with the mule driver, not the mule. Enough. Alright, you need to shut the hell up, homie. Well, we made it. I won't mention you on the complaint form. Not your ass, I hope. I covered that job, all right? Now stay off the rock. You feel me? I'm high on life now, baby. It's a new dawn. Just what I need, police! Heard of Jackson Skinner? He's head of product development at Facade. Man, we must read different magazines. And the bastard made a fortune selling customer data to the highest bidder from Moscow to Tehran. He's handing it to the cyber terrorists on a fucking silver platter. Okay, dog, chill. Shit, chill. I got you, man. What's the play? I'm reliably informed that he has a weakness for working girls. There's a regular he likes to pick up in La Puerta. You stake her out, and she should lead you to Skinner. I'll send you the location. Meanwhile, maybe I'll take another look at the fruit share price. <laughs> All right, homie. I'll be in touch. Damn, that must be my girl. Hey, what 
What up, girl? You won't get down? Not today, honey. I'm waiting for someone. Whatever. You ain't nothing. I'm out of here. Hey, baby, what can I get for ten bucks? You can get the bus home and jerk off thinking about me. Get the fuck out of here. Hey, baby. You miss me? I was starting to think you weren't coming. Oh, I always come. Aw, you such a smooth talker. You know, I wouldn't feel bad about it. Hey man, I'll wipe that software for you. Ah, excellent news. I'll speak to you soon. Oh. 
So who the fuck don't you like today? Guys called Isaac Penny, ruthless vulture capitalist, about to take a controlling interest in Vapid Motor Company and sell thousands of workers down the river. Penny's uh, one of those tight-fisted billionaires, rides the same bus to and from work every day. I was thinking you could take over the route and... Drop the ass off where he needs to go. I got it. Good. Oh, one thing. If I was you, I wouldn't buy any Vapid stock until the acquisition falls through. Hey, sorry I'm late. It's my first day on the job. Hey, look out! We got no seatbelts back here! What happened to the old bus driver? I really like that guy. Damn, would it kill you people to crack a smile? Leave it. Who farted? Come on, that's disgusting. Hey, get in, we're running late. Oh, man, there's an up and atom burger box under my seat filled with vomit. Did anyone see fame or shame last night? I can't watch that Laszlo anymore. He's like a man in a woman's body or a woman in a man's body. I don't know, he just really weirds me out. Jesus, have you been drinking? What? This driver is a fucking lunatic. Well, you're late, late, late. That'll be 150. Mr. Penny, ain't he? Fair hike. Forget about it. Spent thrifts. Hey! Blame hey! it on the city! Oh my god! He's got a gun! I'm going to the police! Did he just run that person over? Just business shit, you know how it is.
Light, good to go. So I take it I can count on your attendance, friend. Huh? At the smoke-in. We're what? We're gonna bring down the government by smoking weed together in a public place. It's very effective. I'm prepared to be a martyr, friend. Are you? Shit, if being a martyr means to smoke good weed, for sure. And you like a little warm-up? You know, before you go and collect the supplies? Before I what? You know, get the supplies. Can't have a smoke-in without smoke. You know, cerebral stuff that's going to get the people up off their feet protesting. Man, I don't know. It sounds kind of bullshit to me. We're going to crush them with our resolve. Here. <clears throat> Have a little taste of that. <clears throat> hmm. Just a mellow, sophisticated high. Man, this seems a little dry. Can't you see the aliens? Man, what else are you taking? Man, this shit is garbage. Anyway, just get the stuff. It's a revolution, and then call me. Crazy motherfucker. San Andreas needs you. I I'll text you where the stuff is. Hey, go quick before someone sees you. And look out for the cops and the monsters. They're everywhere. I'm being watched. The cops are on to me. Get out of here. You know too much.
What's wrong with her now? Dispatch, we got eyes on the perp. We're in pursuit. Magic touch?
Man, are you fucking kidding? I shouldn't have never listened to that high-ass fool. Whoa, who changed my ringtone? Hey, look, man, that car in La Puerta is a fucking hoop. The engine is fucking shot, man. I'm gonna grab the stash and get the fuck out of here. No, no, it could be a trap, and I need that car. The movement depends on it. You'll have to push it or something. Are you out of your damn mind? Hey, do it for your state. Do it for freedom. Do it for nature. Ignite the fight. You have been igniting the fight too motherfucking much, dawg. Mom, I've said all there is to say. What? Man, get your ass down here. I'm outside with this junker you made me drag across town. Look, just leave it there. I can't come out now. The satellites. I mean, they're scanning our brains and tracking our heartbeats through the internet. Go now while you still can. <sighs> Man, I'm wasting my fucking time. No, you're a hero, a green warrior. We're changing lives. No problem. Come on, man. I'm gonna wreck you. Man, I'm sorry, <laughs> fool. Yeah? Bring it. Pump the fist. Hey, fuck you, bitch. Man, fuck you. <laughs> Looks like you're SOL, <laughs> asshole. <laughs> Taking a break from the oppression of technology. Everything hurts. I'm gonna oh, be using fuck. your car.
Excuse me, sir. Can I talk to you for a second? The fuck are you talking about? I am talking about a hotline straight to heaven that this state makes illegal. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. I don't give a fuck about reefer. No, no, they rigged the vote. I saw the ballots. It's a lie. It's democracy at work, amigo. Democracy can suck my fatty. Democracy only works when it lets intelligent people do what they want. This, this is tyranny by morons. <laughs> yeah, well, they got things to take care of in a little place called reality. You want a drag? Nah, I'm not a drug guy. This isn't bushweed. This is mana. I grow it myself. No paranoia, no weirdness. A passport to nirvana. Fuck, give me this. Yeah, here you hardly feel it. Yeah, I smoke all day and I'm fine. It's a pure, mellow high. But I do get concerned about the monsters. Yeah. I mean... I'm sure they're nothing serious, but, uh... I never let them get too near. Oh, the fuck is that? After that, you see, the liquor companies push for continued prohibition, which is complete insanity. <laughs> so I take it I can count on your support. The fuck just happened? What are you talking about? We discussed globalization, the state. Stay the fuck away from me. What? But it's a good cause.
bullshit. This. It's a thing. You said you wanted work. This is work. Uh-huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes? Hi. <laughs> oh. Hello. We're looking for Mr. Madrazzo. Patricia, for fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. <laughs> Patricia, get us something to drink, would you? Quickly! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. Uh, this is my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. So, what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazo? Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The He's... truth. Martin is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. Uh, uh, some people. <laughs> They no longer fear me as much as they used to, people who wear clothes to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you met in Michael. Uh. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about testifying against me. So I have him killed. I'm going to. Huh? By you. Our debt was settled. This is a favor. For a friend. What does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello? What's the deal? This is him. Javier, he's flying off to Liberty City this afternoon. <whistles> and he's taking some files of mine. Innocent files that um, I need back. There's a gun set up in the hills. I have a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by, shoot him down and get the files back. A man was a pay. <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want the drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right. You grab a vehicle, something versatile. I'll handle the gun. All right! Hey, and let's stay in touch on the headsets. Brainless fool! You asshole! You are utterly ridiculous! You puddle of vomit! You make me want to emigrate! You hideous mistake! Uh, Listen, nobody likes you. How are you allowed to walk the streets, moron? Oh, you give me hives. You are such an ass! Why, oh why do you exist? You are an idiot! You look like you struggle with simple tasks. Leave it alone, aight? Okay, well, I ain't at the observatory yet. Start heading that way. By the way, I know why you took me there. To that guy's house? Understood. Understood what? That he's a terrifying psycho and that you might have that in common? What is it? We gotta work for him. We don't gotta work for anyone, but I read you, man, loud and clear. What are you talking about? All that Aztec stuff. Those weird little artifacts. What? Statues, whatever. The guy has trouble getting it up. We'll clear two, three million on those. Easy. Perverts will pay anything for hope. We weren't casing the joint. We didn't agree to a fee for this job. So what's it all about? Okay. The guy lives well. That don't mean we're robbing him. But it does mean he's got money to pay people who help him. When the time comes, he'll do the right thing. 
If he don't, please, let me handle it. You don't get a wife like that without being rich and an asshole, right? The fuck? I see the van with the gun in it. You nearby? Not far out. Shoot the plane down and I'll be ready. T, if you could see this gun, it might convince you Martin Madrazo ain't someone to be messing with. The fancier the gun, the bigger the pussy who owns it. Now take down the jet. There it is. Out past downtown. The jet's moving. Gotta give a lead. Sure 
thing, but seriously, bro, coming all the way out here, we gotta get paid. Just do the job. I'll get us paid down the road. Call the cops. I'm working with the government. You gotta help us. Madrezzo and explain the human cost of this errand. Oh, take it easy, man. Listen to me. We'll talk about that later. I want you to just drop off the files. I gotta get rid of this rifle, then we'll talk. Change of plans. You don't need to come to the ranch. Meet me at Stoner Cement Works, a little up Sonora Road from there. What are you doing, Trevor? Nothing you wouldn't do. Trevor! Trevor! Ah, I wouldn't do. Somehow I don't believe that.
Where is he? Uh, the fuck has happened? Why do you have his car? Piece of turd, huh? No wonder people are stabbing him in the back. What happened? Cheap bastard. You know, I really don't know why you mess around with people like that, Mike. I mean, really, I Tell don't. Him. Answer a fucking question. I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. Then he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. Oh, shit. What the fuck did you do? Oh, I just told you what I just did. Now, oh, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while while, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you hop in the back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can hang out, you know? It's a, a very relaxing little spot. A little getaway, if you will. A cabin in the woods. You know what I'm saying. Good chop. Take yourself home, boy. <laughs> are gonna see this. Look out for Blake! Ugh. You're goddamn loaded!
What can the best mechanic in LS do for you? You have any problems, you bring her back to me. Just looking at that engine. 